Hiya, we're up the allotment today. Um, it's going to get dark soon, so um, it's a bit of a flying visit, but we're hoping to get a row of potatoes in today. So it'll be our first row of potatoes. And I'm really sorry if the sound is atrocious, but the wind up here is a nightmare. And the phone, um, my phone that I film on is slowly shutting down so it won't accept a microphone or anything like that and uh, it's even a real struggle to be able to try and get any video off the phone so hopefully I'll get a replacement soon you never know um, but yeah anyway I'll show you what potatoes we've got now so I've brought these potatoes up they've been um, chitting on the windowsill for a while these are our first earlies and they are ca called um, Charlotte potatoes. So we're hoping to get a row of those in today. So we've pulled the tarp back and um, a lot of the weeds have died off really well. It's not too bad underneath. So really happy about that. Graham's just leveling it out a bit. I don't know why. <laughs> but um, we're going to dig a row of pota potatoes just next to this wood chip path along here. Right so we've um, quickly dug a little trench and I'm going to put some manure in the bottom of it um, just to give a little bit of extra food for the potatoes. So this is our little trench here next to the path that we've dug. There, thanks Nancy for showing it off for us. <laughs> so we're just going to put a, um, a bag of manure down at the bottom of the trench to put a little bit of feed in there for the potatoes, help them grow. Um, as always, it's blowing a gale and it's raining, so, <laughs> so much for sunny Devon, huh? Oh, I just just fell over a bit of wood. <laughs> oh yeah, that's he's found a little grub. There we go. In the shaded bit skin. That will do it, we'll put the rest on the top. That's it, we'll just put them in with the little chits facing up. And so they can grow where they need to. About that far apart. So, so they don't grow in into here. each other. Put one there for me. There we go, that's it. And then we We've got a few left over that we might put in some buckets at home. Right, Graham's just raking um, the dirt back over and I fell over again. 
uh, <laughs> I'm gonna get a rake and give him a hand. So we've covered the potatoes over and just tipped the last bit of manure on the top so it just sort of gives a clear mark as to where the potatoes are and I might just go and get a little bit of wood chip to put next to them as well. Oh, lovely job, Nancy. <laughs> So I've just been and got some wood chip with Nancy and we've just made like a little footpath, just a narrow footpath next to the potatoes and then the next row of potatoes are going along here at some time, hopefully within the next week. Show you, just want to show you these amazing tulips, I've got lots popping up and they just look so nice. I've even got over here some wonderful daffodils aren't they beautiful and these fancy ones a lot of them got blown over in the wind so i had to sort of take them home because they'd snapped the stems but they're just so gorgeous So that's it for this uh, video, um, it's getting dark, it's raining, the small person is screaming in the background because <laughs> that is life. <laughs> um, so yeah, cheers for, cheers for joining us and uh, hopefully I'll see you in another video soon, bye bye.